Welcome to the spoken tutorial on printing a presentation. In this tutorial, we will learn about the various options for printing slides, handouts, notes, and outline. This tutorial is recorded using Ubuntu Linux OS version 18.04 and LibreOffice Suite version 6.3.5 Printing option is useful when we need to print hard copies of our presentation. When we may want to give copies of our presentation to our audience for later reference. Let's open the presentation sample-impress.odp which we saved earlier. This file has been provided to you in the code files link on this tutorial page. Please download and extract the file. Make a copy and then use it for practicing. Let's learn how to take a printout of our slides in various formats. There is a print icon in the standard toolbar. Notice the tooltip on the icon displays a shortcut key Ctrl plus T to print the slides. Click on the print icon. The print dialog box opens. Close the print dialog box for now. I will demonstrate another method to open the print dialog box. Click on the file menu in the menu bar and then click on the print option. In the print dialog box, we see two tabs, namely General and LibreOffice Impress. Let's look at the options under the LibreOffice Impress tab first. Let's start from the document section. By default, in the drop down of the type field, Slides option is selected. To see other options, click on the drop down of the type field. The options in the type field are unique to impress. These options allow us to take prints of slides in other formats such as handouts, notes and outline. Look at the print preview of the slides on the left hand side. There are previous and next page icons here. Scroll through all the slides in the print preview window to see how they will be printed. Under the content section, by default, the hidden pages checkbox is selected. We will select slide name and date and time checkboxes also. This will print the name of the slide with date and time and also the hidden pages if any. Under the color section, let's select the grayscale radio button by clicking on it. Under the size section, we will select fit to printable page radio button. You can explore the other color and size options in the LibreOffice Impress tab on your own later. Next, let's look at the options under the general tab. Under printer, we will select our configured printer's name. Go to the page layout section. Various options are available in the page layout section. In the orientation field, we will choose the option landscape. In the pages per sheet field, we have the number 1 by default. This means it prints one slide on the page. On the right hand side of the order field, we see a rectangle box displaying number 1 as well. This is a preview of the slide number as per the option in the pages per sheet field. Let's say we want to have more than one slide on the same page of the printout. So in the pages per sheet field, we can choose the number of slides that we want to print per page. We will choose 
2 in this field. Now we see a preview of slide numbers 1 and 2 in the rectangle box. We can also see a preview of two slides per page in the print preview on the left. Now let's choose 4 in the pages per sheet field and see what happens. Immediately we see a preview of slide numbers 1 to 4 in the rectangle box. Likewise, we see a preview of 4 slides per page in the print preview on the left. Next, click on the checkbox of draw a border around each page. This creates a black border around each slide while printing. This makes the page look more attractive. Finally, to print the slides, click on the OK button at the bottom right corner. If your printer is configured correctly, the presentation should start printing now. Next, let's learn how to take the print of slides in handouts format. Click on the print icon in the standard toolbar. In the print dialog box, click on the LibreOffice Impress tab. Click on the drop down of the type field and choose the handouts option. In the slides per page field, according to layout option is selected by default. This displays 5 slides in the print preview on the left. But from slides per page, we can select any number of slides we want to print as handouts. I will change this to 3. Leave all other options unchanged for this presentation. Finally, to print the slides, click on the OK button at the bottom right corner. If the printer is configured correctly, the presentation should start printing now. Next, let's go to the first slide and click on the Notes tab. Click on the Click to Add Notes and type, This is a sample note. Then click anywhere outside the text box. Let's print our notes which we typed for our slides. As before, click on the print icon in the standard toolbar. Notice that LibreOffice Impress tab is now directly open in the print dialog box. In the drop down of the type field, choose the notes option. Now look at the print preview of the slide on the left. It shows the note which we had typed earlier at the bottom of the print preview. Scroll through all the slides in the print preview window to see all the other notes that we typed. Click on the OK button at the bottom right corner. If the printer is configured correctly, the printer should start printing now. Lastly, let's print the outline of the slides for quick reference during a presentation. Once again, click to the print icon in the standard toolbar. In the drop down of the type field, choose the outline option. Now, look at the print preview of the slide on the left. It shows the outline or the sequence of our slides with the slide headings and sub points. Click on the OK button at the bottom right corner. If the printer is configured correctly, the printer should start printing now. Let us save all the changes we made in our presentation by clicking on the save icon. And then close the file. With this, we have come to the end of this spoken tutorial. Let us summarize. In this tutorial, we learnt about the various options for printing, slides, handouts, notes, and outline. As an assignment, open practice-impress.odp file. Print two slides per page. Print all slides in black and white including its date and time on it. Print only the first four slides as a handouts. The video at the following link summarizes the spoken tutorial project. Please download and watch it. 
we conduct workshops using spoken tutorials and give certificates. For more details, please contact us. Please post your timed queries in this forum. The Spoken Tutorial Project is funded by MHRD, Government of India. This tutorial was originally contributed by Desi Crew Solutions Private Limited in 2011. This is Arvind and Manish from IIT Bombay signing off. Thank you for watching.